people. You don't know it's cooking vibe. I've done this video five times now because it's just long, bro. Oh my days. Do you know how many times I've done this video, people? It is long, man. Do you know why? Because I had to come outside, bear stress, kids. Ah, oh, quarantine time is killing me. Me, I tell you. But you don't know. We have a go out all the fiat. Is it me? McDonald's is closed. Done. Done. But we got. McDonald's for you. Homemade style. Is it my say? Jamaica, don't worry that you ain't got McDonald's because we got it right here on Cook and Vibe. Yeah, Zibby. Yeah, you don't know, but before I get into it, people, I've got a couple things I want to talk to you about. I've got a brand new single out right now. Right now, so check that out. Chop, chop. Popping up the streets in my Italian shoes. If it ain't making money, dog, I ain't gonna pull up in the morning. Featuring Lavish Bigger. You don't know, so go check that out. The link will be in the description below. Second of all, we got a Rats Kitchen part two. Yeah. Right. Come right I'm closing my eyes, I'm closing my eyes, they're closed. They're closed. Mind the con, man. Ah. All right. All right, open. Whoa. So if you want to see that, give us 50,000 views on this and 1,000 likes. Bing bang bosh, simple thing. Rats Kitchen part two. You don't know people, hope you enjoy today. And uh, I hope it helps you with the kids, gives them something to do, and just passes one day at least. Is it my say? So, why are you? It's cook and vibe. What? All right, people. So this is where you're going to need to make a homemade McDonald's, right? You're going to need three pieces of red card and one piece of yellow. I've had to use two pieces of yellow because we have woolly pack kids here. You know what I'm saying? And we didn't, didn't have enough. So, yeah. But you use three piece of red card, right? Now, card you should use, but we could only get paper. And getting them colours there is, is, a, is a mission, right? No. So, I mean, papers are right. We try it already and everything good, you know. So, yeah, man. Three pieces of red card, one piece of yellow. You don't know. We've got two pieces of red, two pieces of yellow. You need some glue, scissors, pen, and a ruler that I stole off my door. So, first of all, you just want to fold the red card or paper we're using in half two times. All right. And then you want to measure 10 centimeters down in the middle. On each Long, of them, yeah. yeah. Now, what you want to do next is come four centimeters from the top, yeah. Four centimeters from the top, that little mark. And then all we want to do is just in an M shape, we want to just, yeah. And then we're just going to come in the middle there. Like that. Next, we're just gonna cut round our M. What you need to have is you need to have a M square, M square. Our M square, M square. I'll show you what to do next. Yeah, so what we're gonna do next is you're gonna get your, get your M on your red card and you're gonna put it on a yellow piece of paper, right? This is how I do it. I just try and do it as easy as possible. Come on, like arts and craft. I mean, I never, isn't me? I'm using me a little bit, but is it? So now we're gonna cut these out, okay? Once you've cut out your M, you wanna just use some glue. Nah, I just mashed up the last one, which weren't that funny, still. But like I said in the last video before, I did mash it up. Don't mash up this one, Emda. Is I ain't used a prit stick since school, blood. Years, me no use one of them there. Yeah, don't know, man is not an arts and craft guy. Man is a man is a music man, so don't laugh at my attempt. All right, but. We sort of got that guy not near you in the mean. So we just do that, do that. That's the best way to stick it down, yeah? Best way, you can't get a better way than that, you in the mean. Now all you want to do is uh, make sure it don't stick to that. So now, like I say, you just want to do the same thing with the other piece of paper, yeah? Bing, bang, bosh. To say that, trying to find the end of... Sellotape is one of the worst things in the world, blood. Along with traffic, line it up. Alright. And you just like a bit sound. Sellotape. And 
you're gonna connect them together like that fold that on the bottom like that <laughs> could have been done with a little bit closer but it's all right and on this right here we're just gonna lay down the sellotape if it ever comes off my finger get off please no please now come on come on get off bum come on oh my god <laughs> Get off, bro! Thank you. Finally, people, yeah? Rotted. So. Just. Put that on there like that. And then what you're going to do. You're going to fold that in. Fold that in like that. Told you that's the best way to stick it like that. Trust me, brava. Yeah? You nearly got Saint Gan on it. Alright. So next what you're gonna do is you're just gonna cut down car. This bit's still gonna be up here, little piece. So you wanna just cut it down and just fold it. Fold it like that. And do the same thing with the other side. Alright? And then we're just gonna cut these two bits off, okay? Ruler, bosh, 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 bosh. And then all we're gonna do is we are gonna cut just a little outside the box. So it's got some, some room to flap up, you see my All right. And once we've got that, what we're going to do is we're just going to cut in the corner there. Cut in the corner there. Each side. Cut in the corners. Once you've done that, you just want to fold each side. So then, here's it. <laughs> anyway, alright, so this week just going to plunk your little box inside there, right? And all we're going to do is we're just going to put it to the edges like that and stick some sellotape onto it, right? But in the end, you're going to end up with something like that after you've cut out a little M on a yellow piece of paper. You don't need me to tell you how to do that. And you've got a little McDonald's little... Did it mean? Happy meal and that blood! You win the need for go McDonald's again! That's it! So yeah, we got all right. So we're gonna show you how to do our little burger wrap things and and our little fries. We we know we're, we're not really gonna wrap up the burgers, car. That's just a bit of a long thing. But we're gonna do a little fries pack. You know what I'm saying? So um, we will show you what to do next, and then uh, just chuck the food together. Is it what I say? And for the little fries bag, I just cut out a piece of paper, cut out the other piece of the same size, stick them together with some sellotape, cut out a little M. You get me? You got a little fries pouch. You're the main! All right, this is real simple, yeah? So just to do the McDonald's, we're not gonna make everything, yeah? Because this is just something to do with the kids, them. You know what I'm saying? Making it real nice and simple. So I went Iceland's, just got some French fries. Boom, ready for the fries packet. Nuggets, 30 nuggets, two quid. Get in there! You're the main! Yeah, man, obviously, rolls uh, for the burgers, just some mince, beef, uh, egg to, you know, blend it together, some cayenne pepper, some salt, just blend that together, you know what I'm saying? Make some patties and fry them or put them in the grill, wherever you want, cook burgers, real simple thing, come on, if you don't know how to make burgers, then minimum what I've gone. Is it me? And just some uh, some cheap cheese just to go with the burgers, you know what I'm saying? So, um... That is all we are going to use for our McDonald's today. Because the kids them said, so what you want? If you could have got McDonald's, what you want? What you would have want? Would you would have want a, a cheeseburger or chicken nuggets? Them say chicken nuggets and cheeseburger. So I said, yo, you know what? We can make it happen. You can get chicken burger. Uh, what the, I've just made up. What is chicken? There's no chicken burger. <laughs> 
All right, you can have cheeseburger and nuggets. You get me? Because that sounds really right. Yeah, so what we're going to do with the burgers, right? Is we're going to wrap the burgers up in this greaseproof paper. We're going to put a little bit of this in the, in the bottom of the boxes. Yeah, and um, we're going to put a little bit of this in the fries packets, in the little paper packets so the chips don't stick. Pass me one of them fry packets there, darling. Yeah, we're just going to, let me put some inside there. And then wrap up the burgers in there. You see me? The drinks now. I mean, I'm being a little bit naughty and giving the kids a treat and letting them have Coca-Cola, but you should really give them fruit shoots. Just get a pack of fruit shoots, bing, bang, bosh. You know what I'm saying? And then you're done though. No, I'm just using these cups because I couldn't get the uh, the white ones, but the white ones would look a lot better and just stick a little M on there. Do you know what I'm saying? We was gonna do we was gonna draw it on with a crayon, a yellow crayon, but yeah, we ain't got time. I've had, I've had enough for one day, blood. I'm telling ya. So yeah, drink to you. Yeah. So I just as for the toys, I just got these, man. You get me? McDonald's toys are rubbish, anyway. <laughs> but yeah, man. Two ninety nine. Big man. We have it. Our finished Happy Meal. We got our fries in a little bag. Let inside it. We got our little nuggets. We got our burger. We got our toy. You see me? Look funny, look funny. You see me? McDonald's, man, at home. People don't waste the box. Yeah, don't dash it where you can use it again. I've had another idea. Yeah, I've, had, I've got some cheap pancakes. I put some syrup on them and I found these sausage things, the exact same things that they do in McDonald's blood. Six for like £2.30 in Tesco's. You know what I mean? So, McDonald's breakfast, why aren't